Hey there everybody, this is Stacia Lou and I'm at bit.ly.com. I wanted to show you this shortener. I've been using it for a long time. Um, it's free and there's several of them out there. That'll, it's a link shortener that will take your long links on your website or whatever website that you're on that you want to share with and it'll actually track your where you are clicking on them and give you some analytics it helps a lot to shorten your links so that when you share them on Facebook or Twitter or anyways you 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 know you can save a lot of the character space especially on Twitter if you're only you know able to to um, send out 40 characters you want to save as many characters you can so if you wanted to share a link you can shorten it using bitly so bitly is bitly dot com join it's free I don't get paid to promote it or anything just wanted to share you this this tutorial on how to use it um, there's several of them like I said out there um, there's no rhyme or reason why I use different ones or not um, I like bitly and you can just go in it'll shorten it so it says something like this site here I did bit dot ly is their acronym and then they'll do a backslash and they'll automatically enter a um, you know code or numbers to it you can actually click here and change them and if it's a uh, URL or in their system available like if I wanted to I could change this to iWriter or or, or you know use a certain acronym or whatever so when I shared it with people I could say hey go to bit.ly you know bit.ly backslash you know one two three four or iWriter since I'm I did an article on iWriter here and if you click view stats you can see how many people clicked on it I just did this a few seconds ago so no one's clicked on it but if I scroll down and show you a different site um, let's see this, this one has two clicks on it and click view stats and then it'll show you um, you know when they clicked on it what time and from what time period so all you do is um, while well that's loading sorry I, you, I all I did was grab this URL of the the article that I wanted to share and let me go back here on the top here you just paste a link here where it says paste a link there you just paste it in there and then um, you know it pops up paste URL save it and it'll shorten it for you and then it pops up and shows you what the uh, shortened URL so like I said earlier in another video I use uh, Amazon links as you can see here Amazon's um, affiliate link is, is really long look how long that is and like for you to, sh to just grab that link and share it with people it just looks like a gobbledygook a mess so when you do it on bit.ly and you paste the, that link in, up in here it gives you the short version and for Amazon they must have something special with them so they've shortened it to AMZN dash TO but normally it would be you know bitly bit bit dot ly and then a bunch of numbers at the end so um, that's how you use it I actually also have the bookmark tool so um, let me see here it's I think I made have hide it, my bookmarks up here but um, let's see if I can bring it down where's my bookmarks show bookmarks hello people so your bookmark bar, there it is, is my bitmark. So I could actually click that link here and Bitly is going to pop up automatically. So maybe I'm not, you know, if you have this shortened, um, the bitmark on your, um, on your um, bookmark bar, then you, all you have to do is when you're browsing around a website say oh I want to share this website all you have to do is go to the top there and click bitmark and then this is gonna pop up and then you just click copy and then use that use that link so 
in order to get that bookmark bar up there, all you have to do is go back to bit.ly. If I can get back to it. Let me see where it is. If you scroll down, there should be information to add that somewhere. Uh, sorry, it's not there. Hold on. Uh, maybe in here somewhere. Hold on. Right up there. And click. I'm gonna click my name down here. This should should have some kind of um, extra tools. If I click on that arrow here tools there it is so you I guess you just go to the top here where your name is your username click tools and it should show you there it is so they give you instructions on how to do it you just all I did was take this and drag it up to my bookmark bar see it shows you how to put it up there sweet we got you up there drag it up there now so you just drag it up there yeah, I already have it up there though. So that's how you use bit.ly.com. If you have any questions, I'm going to do another tutorial on a different um, shortener that I use. And there's just little differences between bit.ly.